What is going on YouTube? It's your boy Spanko back with another vlog at Emmett. You already know what it is. Today they're actually hosting their very first box tournament. Again, this store is fairly new to the Yu-Gi-Oh scene and it's been growing like crazy. So it's their very first box tournament and I wanted to support the store. So here we are today. And if you guys want to support the store and support your boy, use code SPANKO5 on their website. You guys get 5% off any Yu-Gi-Oh purchase that you guys make. So make sure to support them, support the store, support me. You know how it is. And let's get in there and see if we can win today's box tournament. Let's go. I'm gonna be honest. I am uh, not feeling the best right now. Uh, my body aches. I had a fever last night. My throat, you guys can tell, it's not the greatest. Pause. But I will say that we're going to get through this. And we're still gonna play because if you guys don't know, I have a wedding coming up, which means uh, I'm not gonna actually be able to play Yu-Gi-Oh! very often from now until that wedding. On the bright side, we don't have to think because we're playing Shifter. So if I could just turn off my brain, play this card, we're pretty much good to go. So we'll see how today goes. Oh, I wanna, there's a special guest here today. There's our special guest. Yeah, he's looking at Shifter with disgust. But he's playing RDA today. So you guys could get some RDA content today. And then the Locals was actually supposed to start at uh, 12.30. It's currently 1.14. So we're like 45 minutes behind. Typically, local starts at 1, and I feel like a lot of people thought it still started at 1 for today's box tourney. So I guess we're just waiting on people. I mean, it's still 1.15, so people are still late. But regardless, guys, if I open hands like this, it's over. The amount of disgust Alpha's looking at me with... <laughs> guys, we got this, we got this. Alright guys, so we just finished our round 2. There's only 3 rounds today, actually, funny enough. There's 2 boxes for the prizing, and it's top 3. It's not top 4, it's top 3. Now, round 1, I uh, end up playing as Voice's Voice. Go to game 3. So here we are in our round one, game one, of course, we end up losing the die roll, but I did have shifter, which is kind of nice. Now, that kind of stops his turn. However, we're not able to push super far either. He does have an imperm on our hand, isn't the greatest. Now, we do have the Kishira preparations, but he has a uh, ghost ogre for that, which kind of sucks. He doesn't really have any much in hand, though, so he passes it back, and we're able to take game one. Now, game two, he's able to set up a full board. I opened no hand traps, and you guys are going to see it's not the full board. It's the fact that he ends up on double solemn judgment set plus a dimensional barrier set. So he's able to call Ixies on Dimensional Barrier. I'm not really able to make much of a board. Of course, once I pass it back to him, he's going to be able to push for a lot of damage and go for a game over here. So we end up losing game two. Now, game three, I have full combo, the standard Kishira combo. However, the issue here is that uh, he opens Dark Ruler no more and evenly match, which you guys are about to see, which absolutely sucks, destroys my entire board. Now, he's able to set up, but slowly I'm able to pick apart his board. And you guys are going to see he's going to go into turns like five, six, seven here. And once we get Scareclaw Kishtira into loop with Kishtira Birth and Kishtira Fenrir, we're able to slowly pick apart his board, break it one by one, and then uh, at the end, you guys are going to see we're able to push for a ton of damage, and we're starting to build our board here as well. Once you get the loop going, you're pretty much good to go. I break his entire board, and we go for game. Oh, I'm going to finish. Uh, again. Uh, banish Theosis. Theosis, I'm not going to be careful. Go ahead. Uh, let's see if that top deck makes the game. Draw, I'll face. Is it evenly? Sure. And the bell? Sure. Sure. What's the card? Top banner. Yeah, because I banish it. Yeah. yeah. You go send, I go banish. And yeah, nothing. and then nothing happens. It's a tough game three, but we end up winning our round one. Now, round two, we're up against Raid Raptor. I four. Four, it's not very high, baby. Five. Five yeah. Barely, barely. I'll go first. <laughs> Good luck, bro. Oh, I drew the card. Hand kind of sucks, but let's go. We ball. We ball. We ball. Standby? Yes, sir. Shifter? Yes, sir. And Raid Raptor, I'm not going to lie, was a matchup that I felt pretty good about, but uh, we go into game one. I got game one. We go into game two. He full combos me. I don't draw a hand trap. It is what it is. Now we go into game three and... Um, Bro, he puts sets up two towers. I don't know what to do against towers. But uh oh wait, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. We just we just won. There we go. Is this is raffle? Oh, yes, Thank sir. you. you These to, are sick. You get to pick. And these are pins? Yeah, yeah. Pick one. I get to take one. You get to pick one. This is tough. I think I have to take Ash. Well, I was thinking Baron, but I think I might take Ash. It's not feet. <laughs> it's not feet is hilarious. Yeah, let me get the ash. Let me get the ash. Bet, bet, bet. Thank you guys. Thank you guys. All right, while they're doing the rest of the raffles and giveaway, I uh, actually ended up putting the ash over here. Pretty lit. Anyway, so like I was saying, yeah, round two, we're playing up against Raid Raptor, and uh, game three, he just put up the towers. I mean, I was, I was just, it was an uphill battle, unfortunately. So 
Yeah, we ended up losing our round two. However, we are going to round three, our final round. Now, the breakdown is first place gets a box, second place gets 16 packs, and third place gets eight packs. So we're playing for third place right now. And if we get third place, we can at least leave here with eight packs, which is going to be really fun. And I'll open up those packs. It's going to be really fun as well. Actually, we also got a ton of OTS packs, but uh, I like to save these for other videos. So I'm not going to open them up right now. But uh, yeah, it looks like everyone's just uh, celebrating their uh, raffle winnings. But uh, yeah, it's been a fun day so far. Let's play our last round. A few moments later. That was not a great round three. We were hoping for third place, but I'm gonna be honest, guys. Um, I wasn't at my, so yeah, they, they put the standings up. It's not very fun, but um, it's okay, it happens. Alpha, actually, funny enough. Here's Alpha right over here, first place. And uh, if you guys wanted to see his first place RDA deck profile from last locals, he just came first place again, this locals with RDA which is crazy. Um, I'll link it in the top of the description. Literally back-to-back -back, uh, locals first place for him. So RDA is a legit deck. So there's uh, uh, Andrew over there. And there he is over there, picking his box because he won first place. On the bright side though, I got some feature matches. So if you guys want to check out a bunch of the feature matches, got them on Spanko Duels. I'll leave a link at the top of the description below. I know, congratulations, I already said you won. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. First place RDA profiles already up on his channel. Are you playing the same list as your first place list? Yeah, so he never changed his list from last time. So same thing, first place. I'll leave the link in the description there as well. Um, the combo videos on my channel so you guys can check it out. Feature matches of how he plays RDA and how the deck works. Because I know you guys were asking about that as well. It's going to be on the Spanko Duels channel. So um, we got two rounds for you, right? Yeah, two rounds. So we got two rounds of RDA so you guys can actually learn how the deck plays, see how it plays and see how it functions. That's it. I guess we call it a vlog. It's a short vlog. You got anything you want to say? You did misplay? He misplayed and he still won. He misplayed and he still won. Anyways, it was a good day. Thank you guys all for watching. And like I said, if you guys ever want to get some discount codes, Spanko 5, 5% off, Emmett's Toy Stop, a link is in the description as well. There's a ton of links in the description. Just check out the description and you guys are going to see some discounts. You guys are going to see some deck profiles. You guys are going to see Spanko duels. Everything in the description. Thank you guys all for watching. And with that, Spanko signing out. Peace. All right, guys. I saw everyone else opening packs. I didn't get to open a pack. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take two. This is a uh, Emmett sponsored video. I'm joking. I'm gonna, I'll pay for these. <laughs> I'll pay for these. All right, take the two random packs. Let's go. I don't. I don't. I shouldn't be doing this, man. I already told myself I've had enough of this set. But you never know. Okay, the Genix Secret Rare. I think the card is supposed to be good. I have no idea what the deck does though. Whatever. That card's really good. It's just a lot of doesn't get interrupted. By it's a Link One. Anytime Link Ones happen. Oh. oh. <laughs> All right, swing me one more. One more. All right. One more, and then I'm done. I'm actually done. I can't do this. I'm doing this for content for you guys, okay? <laughs> one more pack. Yeah, it's an open box, so something could have already been hit. Oh, ancient gear. Okay. That's not very good. <laughs> Run it up. One more. Run it up. How much are the packs? They're four bucks. Okay, I'll, I'll land there. I'll land there. Okay. This is okay. actually like a four or five dollar card. Why? Because it's, it's a fire <laughs> well, card. Good, well good. Yeah, because it's a fire card. You target two or four lower fires. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Alright, we'll take it.